hi so in today's video we will be solving an issue regarding the detection problem of SSDs in predator laptop or any other laptop that has the same problem so let's get started first of all uh, let's turn on the laptop so this laptop is 11th generation and it came with very you know bad condition so we have just uh, managed to uh, you know make it display give a display so it has a fan problem as well but uh, in this video we will be focusing on the error of the ssd that uh, when you attach any ssd the nvme ssd if you will be uh, you know adding to this laptop it will not detect or when you go into the bios it will be showing the uh, ssd into the bios but not in the uh, windows setup so how can you install the windows uh, if the ssd is not uh, being displayed so because of the battery absence the laptop will take time to give the display for the first time so as you will see here we have attached the windows uh, USB here so here we go in order to uh, make the SSD detect in the uh, you know window setup first you need to connect your USB to a working laptop to download the driver for the SSD uh, in my case I have predator I will go to the predator drivers and then from there I actually downloaded the file so here if you will see this intel storage generic driver this is the driver for vmd option of the bios most of the time the bios does not show the vmd option so you need to download the driver for it from its official website uh, for intel storage like i will show you for example if i go to the bios setup so this is the bios setup here if you will go to the advanced features here in the main the option should come over here for the vmd so if vmd is enabled you need to disable it otherwise due to the security uh, concerns the laptop is not going to let your new ssd or the new windows uh, get load on the laptop it will uh, stop the ssd to detect into the window setup so if, if the option is hidden over here you cannot see in my case there is no vmd option so what you actually need to do is to go to the windows setup and then install the driver that you installed from uh, sorry downloaded from the website
as you can see in my case the laptop is not showing the SSD what you will need to do is to load driver here and then go to browse go to your USB where you downloaded the Intel rapid storage driver in my case it is here so if I, I will click over this now you can see it has picked the Intel RST VMD controller driver in the Windows setup. So just select the driver and then next. It will automatically display your SSD. Now you can see same SSD that is installed in the laptop which was not detecting now it is detecting now you can install the windows and whatever you want to do you can do here after installing the Intel rapid storage driver I hope this video will help those who are facing the same issue regarding the detection of the SSDs and are like feeling uh, bad for the SSD so this is actually not the problem of the SSD it is a VMD option that is hidden in your laptop so just install the driver then you can proceed your windows setup thank you for watching bye bye